Hi, I'm Dylan Wilkes, the CTO of Orange Photonics, and today I'm going to talk a little bit about the fundamental technology behind our Light Lab Canvas Analyzer, which we call Selective Separation Spectroscopy. To start with, uh, all the samples that you analyze on a Light Lab are in liquid form, so that involves weighing out a sample and uh, separate or extracting it with uh, some Light Lab solvent. So once you have the, the sample into this liquid form where it's in the solvent, uh, the first thing that you do is you inject the sample into the instrument. And when you do so, it's filling up what's called a, a sample loop. Uh, and the reason we do this is because it allows you to uh, inject any amount of sample as long as you're overfilling this loop. So you don't have to carefully inject uh, a small amount of sample. Once you uh, hit the run button on the analyzer, the sample that you've injected, uh, again this is liquid, gets carried by a pump into the selective separation column, which I'm going to do a terrible job of drawing right here. Uh, just so you know what I'm talking about, here's uh, an example of it right here. So this is where kind of the magic happens. As the sample comes through here, uh, it interacts with, the, there's some material in here called uh, reverse phase uh, chromatography material. And as the sample comes through, it, it slowly interacts with this, this uh, column material. And what ends up happening is the sample, uh, the different cannabinoids uh, have an affinity to the column that are as differs. Uh, so basically some of the sample, is, some of the cannabinoids, I'm sorry, are held very strongly by this column and take a long time to get through, uh, while others come through very quickly. So off the bottom of the column, you might see CBD coming in first, uh, and then THC, and then THCA, and so on. So as you go through, each one of these uh, cannabinoids is coming through. After that happens, uh, the next step is uh, the sample is, is uh, uh, it's irradiated by UV light, so there's a little UV light source inside the device, and the sample goes through what's called a flow cell, so there's a liquid cell with two windows on the other side, and on the other side there's a detector, so we're shining light through the sample and hitting a detector on the other side, and by doing so we're able to quantify the uh, amount of cannab each cannabinoid coming through. Now, uh, once this is done, uh, we're able to use both this, uh, the uh, UV data as well as the chromatography data in order to quantify the samples uh, accurately. And the way we do this in our system is using uh, what's called a linear regression algorithm. And this does uh, some fancy math in order to separate the different cannabinoids even further than they would be with just chromatography alone. One thing to note though is that our system is calibrated directly with uh, calibration standards. So there's no lookup library, anything like that going on. So the device is uh, actually calibrated very similar to what an HPLC would be, uh, which is using analytical standards that are injected into the device during calibration. Uh, this is something that happens at the factory, so you don't have to worry about it. But ultimately, uh, once you go through these processes, the result is a readout on the screen of the, of the six different cannabinoids that we can measure. Uh, and uh, that's the basic process behind uh, the Light Lab. If you want to learn any more, if you have any questions, certainly feel free to get in touch with us or visit our website at orangephotonics.com. Thank you very much.